what's going on guys hope everyone's having a great day hope everyone's staying safe hope everyone's staying healthy i hope you guys have enough uh time in the day because this is going to be a really long stream um so this is going to be the overnight stream uh i am going to be playing uh resident evil village i haven't even uploaded it or i haven't even uploaded it i haven't even uh there we go i haven't turned it on because I want you guys to finish. I want you guys to experience all this with me. So we are going to be playing this. Um, we're going to be doing the campaign. Nothing really big. You know, just a little bit of a casual playthrough. If you haven't already, go ahead and follow this channel. Share it on social media. You can follow me over on Twitter. It's in the bottom left. And my Instagram's in the bottom right. You can go over there and follow me out. If you want to get cool looking merch like this. A little techno gaming uh skull hoodie go over down uh on the about page down below uh, you can actually go and buy some of this yourself you can also get an eye stretcher boyfriend's holes hoodie same way i love this thing make sure you have your blankets pillows drinks snacks we're going to be going at it for quite a while it is 7 12 p.m here this is going to be a really long stream so you know Kick back, relax, enjoy this. This is the weekend. Happy Friday, everybody. Uh, so let's out further ado. Let's get into it. I'm looking forward to having the crap scared out of me. The one thing I will say, though, is I don't know Resident Evil Reverse. I don't even know what that is. Like, that came with the game. I don't know what it is. I haven't loaded it up or anything like that. Uh, but, you know, that's we'll check that out for, like, a different time. This is Resident Evil Village. Let's go ahead and go into it. I got me a drink. I got me some. I don't have any snacks. Oh, no. Oh. I got me a drink, so I'll be good. I may have to take pause breaks every now and then. As you guys do know, I do have scoliosis. So, you know, we're not going to be ending the stream. This is going to be an overnight stream. I may just have to put the stream on pause for a little bit. If you guys like these longer streams, let me know. I have no problem doing it. It's just I may have to put a be right back, uh, you know, a be right back scene into it. I've also been working around with animation and everything. So uh, the stream layout, the casual stream layout will actually be changing. Um, I'll also be adding my own personalized intro into my YouTube videos and outros. So if you want to uh check out I, I suggest checking it out later finish watching the stream but tomorrow there won't be an upload for youtube check out the uh video i already uploaded <laughs> Ooh, my voice cracked check out the video i uploaded on youtube today um if you guys haven't just search up techno gaming you know i leave i you, you should be able to find me on youtube just search up techno gaming YouTube doesn't give me my own URL until I get 100 subscribers. So, you know, we're at seven. Let's see if we can bump those up. Uh, let's see. It wants me press A on the controller I want to use. I am in as dark as it's going to get. It is actually still light outside somewhat. So, you know, maybe a little bit before we can get spooked. But, good. So, you know, we have some bonuses. Village of Shadows, special bonus Resident Evil movie. Okay, so if you guys haven't already, uh, if you guys haven't played through Resident Evil 7, or if you haven't seen any gameplays, uh, hi Alvin, what's up? Also, yeah, Alvin's going to be monitoring the chat. Um, he's not going to be playing. He doesn't have Resident Evil 8, um, but he doesn't really like scary games a whole lot. So he's just going to be monitoring the chat. Um, and quite honestly, I think I can actually, hold up, I want to do something real quick over here for you guys. Um, click here, transform. There we go. Awesome. Because I'm actually looking on a different monitor, so this way you guys can actually see me a little bit better. Okay. Oh, I moved the damn camera. That's lovely. How lovely am I?
Really? Not trying to move one little thing, not the whole thing. Right, that's a little bit better. Go ahead and do that. Move that over. There we go. Alright, if I need to move the camera around for anything so you guys can see something, you know. I'll do that. This way. Alright. Here we go, Resident Evil 7. This is going to be the little movie that you get when you you know, play it. Let's go ahead and see what this is all about. Okay. Where to start? My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. I remember this. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. So it was a mold that did it? The people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. If you chose her, that was a choice. You could choose the other girl too. I remember that part. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. Or is it? So it was a mold that got them. That's what the infection was. Okay. All right. Well, going into the gameplay now, let's actually have the shit scared out of us. Um, I'm not going to do hardcore. I'm probably just going to do standard. I probably should have chose casual, um, considering this is a casual playthrough, but, you know, it, it, we'll see how difficult things get. If things get really difficult, I'll lower the setting. <laughs> I'll see if it'll let me lower the setting down to casual um, so I can actually finish the game. A young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded past as the girl ran on. Very Tim burton key. And into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing Creepy. through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a clip of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate 
and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Give us uh. what you gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn was due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Ah. Uh. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. The woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. So it's a continuation from Seven, the same people. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. Okay, wow. I'm just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. Aww, you cute little baby. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. Who could? Okay, so. Did you say something? Nothing. Nothing. I'll, I'll put, put her down. down. Pausing it real quick. That was really cool. Okay, if you guys actually remember, okay, I don't know how many people of my, I don't know how many of my audience actually watches um, Harry Potter, but if you remember when in the Deathly Hollows, uh, when she's reading the book uh, Tales of the Beetle of the Bard, um, she's talking about the Deathly Hollows, and she's reading it from the book. That kind of animation stuff, that is what reminded me of that that scene so it was very tim burton -esque and i liked that it was very creepy uh also we're playing as the same people from resident evil 7 so this is after you know they left that house and after um you know all of that this is three years that's still evelyn uh you know apparently we have a daughter named rose who's a very cute baby and is getting read a very creepy bedtime story also, there's nothing wrong with reading your baby a, you know, creepy bedtime story. Aw, cute little baby. He's going to sleep. That's so cute. Also, I walk super fucking slow. Aw, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh, shh, shh. shh. I didn't mean to yell. I'm like sorry. To your mom, that book's too scary for you. Uh, this, the details, these graphics are freaking awesome. I'm playing on Xbox One. I'm not playing on my PC right now. That is the bathroom. That is not where you put a baby to sleep. Your mom and I love this song so much. Oh, that's so cute. Almost there, honey. Okay, this is a nursery. Where's the crib? Okay. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Why do I have a bad feeling something's gonna happen to the baby? 
I just have this pit in my stomach saying something bad is going to happen. Rose is closed for tomorrow. Okay. I just, I have this really bad feeling. Also, I'll walk a little bit faster now without the baby. Hang on. I want to explore a little bit. I want to... What's in over here? This is like really dark. Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Yeah, no fucking kidding. Okay. Curtain closes on the Dolve gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into the Dolve tech toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. Jack Baker, 57, and his family, who were exposed to the gas, perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. Uh, the entire area has been closed off by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Oh. Okay, so nobody knows where, you know, we went. And they're calling it a gas instead of the mold, or they're calling it a gas or covering up the actual event. Historical look at the architecture. These from European castles and keeps by George Trevor. Okay. Okay. What, what was that? Why do I even keep this around? I should get rid of it someday. Aw. Wasn't that, isn't that like a little Easter egg? Because isn't there something about, uh, bobbleheads in the old Resident Evil games or something? I can't remember. I think there was. I think they were like collectibles or something. I may be getting confused. I don't know. Oh, pills. Drugs here. Me as a medication has been on a strict regimen ever since the incident. Uh, hi! You know, this game's got really fucking graphics. And then here's the mirror. Not a damn reflection. Uh, are we just not supposed to know what Ethan looks like? I mean... Okay, I wasted enough time. Let's head back downstairs. Anything in here? No. Ooh, some stuff right here. She's asleep. That's why I got a bad feeling something's gonna happen to the baby. Rose's diaper, she's starting to outgrow them. Aw. I'm taking that this is Rose's favorite cartoon. Watching a bunny in a balloon. And a dog. Bye, doggy. Bunny didn't even seem to care to look at you. Yeah, I'll leave that on. Why, why not? Let's leave that on. Alright. Still asleep. We're good. Ooh. Mom got you another new book? Well, Ethan, which one would you rather her be reading? The horror ass the horror book about a witch killing a kid or learning how to read ABCs. I choose ABCs. Why not? Ooh, there's stuff in here now. Oh. Jazz. 
jazz albums you were never able to get when you were young. Huh. Dinner actually looks really damn good, not gonna lie. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, uh, well, like a baby. But she mm, is. That smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. She just touched my hand with a scalding ass uh, spoon. Wow, you've got or a ladle. Native, haven't you? Hmm. Local wine too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just. Finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <sighs> Mia, get down! Oh shit! Mia dead! Oh! oh God. No, there's no living through that. She is dead. Who the? Chris? What the hell? Sorry. What the fuck? What? Why? What the actual hell? Go move. Fuck you. Oh. I'll clear. Get your hand off my baby. Do with my daughter. Package secure. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Fuck you, Chris! Get him off. What the having a lovely dinner and Chris just comes in after moving us here shoots up my wife and then takes my baby knocks my ass out that's fucked up shit went from zero to a hundred real quick hey doc no problem we'll be there that was the doc She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? She said? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just won't. Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Hang up on work and talk to your wife about this. What the fuck's going on? Is there something wrong with the daughter? Aww. Oh, my little angel. Oh, that's cute. These graphics are really freaking amazing. I'm not even gonna lie. Okay, so we're back in the present having the shit knocked out of us. We're out in the snow. Jesus. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you 
talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not part of the portal. Fuck. What the hell happened to you? I don't know, man. You got the shit knocked out of you. That's the fucker. Yeah. It's useless. It just had a freaking s signal not long ago. Pick it up. It's cracked, but fuck. Use it. Mission objectives. Eliminate target. Recover body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two Winters... Winterses... To Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. Your whole job was to just kill my wife? I spent all of Resident Evil 7 saving her ass. And you just lit her up like a piece of paper. Fuck. Alright, we're in the snow. Where's... Footprints this way. Oh, this is. We're venturing into woods. Alright, we're going up this way. I'm gonna follow the footprints. Something you totally never do in a horror game, but. It seems like the right thing. Why does my flashlight only work on the ground? Hey, yo, Ethan, aim the flashlight up a little bit. Do not enter. Ah! Now, the hand that we just had cut off in Resident Evil 7 and had it stitched back on. Also, I can't run. Not yet. This is literally how slow the game is making me move. Hello? Oh, I can't go that way. Shut the fuck up. You know what? Because I'm going to be talking for a while. I don't need you going off trying to scare the shit out of me. Oh. Yeah. That would be a raven. Uh, raven or vulture? Because those are pretty big. And that is... Well then. Those guts have been... What the fuck? What the hell killed all of these birds? <laughs> that actually scared me. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I should be around that bird. What the fuck was that? Walking across the bridge. Well, there's a shack here. Is 
game's very good about keeping you in the dark, because he, he only seems to like to aim his flashlight down. Uh, rope. Hi, uh, I don't know if anyone's here, but, you know, I'm just going to make myself comfy. God, I thought somebody was in that bucket. Okay, no. The fuck? Okay. God damn it. The littlest fucking sound. <laughs> That's how on edge I am right now. Oh crap. Hang on. Uh, here we go. Shouldn't have any more of those happen. Because the uh, last thing I need to get is scared from a notification. Jesus, Ethan, watch where you're fu- Oh. There's blood. Uh, is there an option for noping the fuck out? Yeah. Creepy ass woods. We don't know where the fuck we are. In actuality, I didn't nope the fuck out and said, yep, pieces, you know, you have my daughter, I need to go find them, but I'm not staying in this fucking cabin. I don't even think they have my daughter, or this guy has it. Hmm, huh. kind of Skyrim is key. A little bit over here. That is... Garlic. So I do know there's a vampire lady in here. We can at least say she's not here yet because uh, I'm assuming vampires don't like garlic in this in this story. Salmon. Okay. Is that, hang on, is that like a Catholic? No. Is this supposed to be like a religious photo? If it is, it looks very fucked up. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Oh my god, Ethan, point the flush. Fuck. Great, man, you got scared from fucking boards falling. What the fuck is that? It's an X with some kind of fancy chalk drawing. Alright. Dude, whoever lives here, you need to clean your fucking shit. I got trash bags up everywhere. Ah, uh, nah, nah, man. Nah, fam, nah. Ah, uh, nah, 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 nah. No, no, no. Oh. Oh, shit. I got scared by a goddamn rat. Oh, where the fuck am I supposed to go? I've already been in. Oh, God. There's going to be something behind me, ain't there? Oh, okay. Holy shit. You know, first instinct would be, let's grab- HOLY SHIT FUCK!
been a while since I played a horror game. God damn! The fuck was all that shit? Where did that come from? <sighs> hey, what's up, Cass? What's up? Here, see me get the shit scared out of me. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm getting the shit scared out of me already, and I'm not even that far into the damn game. Oh, shit. Okay, Vampire Lady can't be here. There's too much garlic around here. Is that shirt still here? Yeah, it's still here. Okay. Hi, I just want my baby. I just want my That was up there. That was not down here. How? Oh, no. Oh, no. Is that... Hey, that's, that's me. Okay, that fucking deer head was right there. I fucking looked at it. Okay, I, I, I am... Oh, shit. But hey, damn it. Holy shit, fuck so fast. <laughs> Ooh, grody. Nice. What a... Ethan, shut your mouth, all right? There's something here that does not want us here. What did all this? Obviously, it's enough fucking power to rip through your ass, so I'd stay quiet. Oh, shit. Well, it's a little bit more daytime. I can actually see. All right, climb over it. As long as there's not a screeching bird again. I actually have... The thing is, is I have my headphones up pretty loud. And it's not super dark where I'm at. I guess I could turn off like two more lights and, you know, be fine. I have to keep these lights on so you guys can actually see me. But relatively, I, I am still on edge. Where the hell Ooh, I... pretty. Oh, not pretty. You know, pretty gothic cathedral, but, you know. Yeah, fuck you, bird. You're the one that, your little friend back there got tangled up in a fucking cord and scared me. Alright. Ethan did not learn his shit from last time. I feel so sad. Mia died. She got lit up like fucking paper, though. Damn. Chris Redfield, you fucking asshole. You're a fucking treacherous bitch. What? Uh. Again, Ethan, do you do you think you want to continue going forward? That horse has got a gash in its neck. I'm getting very Harry Potter, Lord Voldemort vibes when it's eating on the fucking unicorn. Uh, okay, those are eggs. Garlic. Keep that. You know, they love garlic here. I think there's, uh, I think it's because there's a fucking vampire here. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe, maybe they're out. I, I'm sure. I'm, I'm sure that's an easy to pick lock. Okay, so we need to find lock picks. There's got to be one here somewhere. Come on, Ethan. You've been in predicaments like this before. It's only been three years. Surely you don't forget a lot of things in three years. I may have to come back to that. I actually cannot run still. I, I can't run. I can't do anything. I still move super slow. Um...
So the chickens are out. Alright. Uh, nothing in there. Oh, I think I just came from there. Hello? Y'all heard that, right? I hate those damn birds. Alright, let's... This needs uh, some kind of other item. Okay. Fuck off! Screechy ass. God. So a shit ton of your friends got killed. Alright. Okay, I guess I do move a little bit faster. Do not enter. Well, you see, there's a sign that said that not long ago back there, and, you know, I think I should have fucking listened to it, but no, no, I decided to get my own head up my ass and think I'm brave. Um. Okay. So I do move a little bit faster. Not super fast, but... There's something down here. Wait. Yeah. Nothing. What the... Okay, no, 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 no. No, no. Those sounded really loud. I can't get up there. What the hell? Well, I guess I'm still... Well, there's nothing over there. I guess I'm still going forward. Can I just hide in the hay like Assassin's Creed? I feel like that'd be safer. What's over here? Anything over here? I'm still looking for that damn lock. If there's any kind of lock picks. No. I didn't check over here. Nope. Okay. Forward on, my wayward son. Let's go. God, I turned what so happened? slow. I also think there may be a werewolf in here. I just, from the previews of the game, I think there's a werewolf. I mean, there's vampires. Why wouldn't there be a werewolf, right? Hey, Ethan, now might be a good time to put out that flashlight, bud. I don't have a button dedicated for that yet. Um, it's locked. Okay. Seeing a lot of locked shit and not a lot of lock picks. Oh. Ethan, flashlight bud, that, that'd be nice. Some force should break it. Uh, yeah, that's nice. I, I really can't, you know... Oh, why is my inventory? LB is to block. Okay. Directional pad is quick assign. Y'all gonna get a kick out of seeing me get the shit scared out of me. I'm just saying. Playing horror games? Yeah, I'm a fucking pansy. We got our first weapon. That's... I'm gonna go back here. Thank you. Alright, we're getting some... I keep stepping on glass! Did they just... Run out of the house? house? More than fucking likely. Did you see the size of that hole? Damn. 
That thing looked like it had even one goal. Anything to grab on in here? Obviously not. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. Oh, oh no. shit! Friendly. Friendly. God. <laughs> I knew something was going to be behind there and it still got big and scared. <laughs>